check that. And who was where did this videotape come from? Pardon? So I think she she's a bit hard, and she's you know personality is strong for the personality, and um, she might be nervous, of course, when they kidnapped her, but uh, but she's a strong lady. Doorstep? No, no. She was going to her office, and when they stopped her, two cars. Release my wife. She is Iraqi. She is working for the uh, humanitarian organization. And uh, I ask you for to release her. How about from the U.S. authorities or from the Ministry of Way, the Holding Up? Well, her family outside, and uh, they are very concerned about that. My family also is same here. As you may know, she is here for 30 years. And she is very close to my family here, as, as an Iraqi she is now. She used to have the uh, Irish nationality, and she is now Iraqi by, by marriage. So, you know, 30 years is, is, is a long time, isn't it? They stop the car and they drag the driver and the, the, uh, the what you call him, he's like, uh, like companion. a companion. And uh, dug them out and then uh, they took the car and went away with Margaret. Or from the Ministry of uh, Interior or anyone, has anyone gotten in touch with you from the... That's her decision because he's working with the, I mean, if care take the responsibility to remove her from, uh, from Baghdad, from Iraq. That's her business. She She's employed by CARE. She loved Iraq. Could you just give us a sense of how she felt about this country, about Iraq? Well, she liked the people, she liked the country. That's why she is here for 30 years. Otherwise, she could have left. There have been no, no demands so far at all. Well, I told her, yes, I warned her before. And I said to her, I said, uh, well, you are as a foreigner. I know she got Iraqi documents, okay. She carried it with her, you know, ID card and passport. But, but there is a fact that she looks foreign. I mean, if the kidnapper want to kidnap her, they, they see her as a foreigner, not Iraqi. And, and we don't even know which, which group it is. Oh, I'm shattered, honestly. I mean, I haven't sleep for since she's been maybe two, three hours, that's all. Since she be kidnapped two days ago. Three days ago. Hello, Carl. I don't know what is the group. I mean, what the kind of group you know, they kidnapped her. Has anyone approached you and said that they could act as a mediator or no, nope. or would like to try? No, I'm trying to find somebody, but uh, I don't know. I didn't make any my investigations to find out because. I really didn't come to my mind that she's going to be kidnapped one day and I'll be in a position to look for somebody to to talk to. What would you say to her right now? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not thinking what to say to her. Come safely to her to your house your family, to the people she loves, and she worked for them.